And before the final whistle blew, well, thousands of local fans packed Southwest University Park to celebrate the return of the locomotive. ABC 7's Tony Gutierrez talked with the local faithful and joins us outside the stadium. Tony. Rosemary Sam, indeed it was a very electrifying atmosphere from start to finish here at Southwest University Park. Fans gather in attendance to show their support and take part in the party that was today's home season opener. From a man dressed as a banana to masked cruzadores and even fans with enormous hats. Fans from throughout the borderland gathered today for El Paso Locomotive FC season opener. We love this city. We bleed blue, yellow, and white. And it just, we come together and we represent. We get a little wild. I get it. But we're here to support our city and to support our team. Despite falling behind early in the game as a result of a penalty, fans cheered throughout the game, a sign that demonstrates the hopes they have for this team this season. This year it's going to be different. It really it is. You can just feel it, it's different. Even just being here on the opening day, it's just more excitement, a different type of vibe than, than uh, previous years, for sure. With this new season ahead, a spokesperson with El Paso Locomotive FC told us fans will be in for treats this season with things like giveaways, fireworks shows, and laser shows. However, what already brings people to the stadium is more than just that. It's just so awesome to see everyone come together at the games and just to enjoy this 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 culture that we have the we have here in El Paso, you know. Soccer, that's our culture and I love that. Vamos locos. Let's go. Vamos locos. Let's make the playoffs, baby. Woo! Now we want to remind those of you at home that you can always live stream the games on our website and on our KVIA app if you are to miss one of the home games. For now, reporting outside Southwest University Park, Tony Gutierrez, ABC7. Thank you, Tony. ABC7 sent you a push alert to KVIA.com so you could stream the game from home if you couldn't make it to the park, as Tony just <coughs> mentioned. That is where all, you can find all of our major alerts. 